Hello friends, welcome to our channel Galaxy of Things. Today we are going to present second session on personality development. In first session we already talked about how you can develop your personality, know yourself. In this session we will focus on body language and professional outlook and some other parameters of personality development. So watch this video. Before that we would like to request you to subscribe and like this channel and video. We welcome your valuable thoughts and suggestions you can give in comment section. As you know well about personality from our first session where we have described how various things matters for your personality development. Like that body language is most important factor to make an impression or other people judge you by your body language. Remember one thing, always be yourself, express yourself have faith in yourself do not copy a successful personality and duplicate yourself the first point is being courteous being courteous is nothing but well mannered means polite or respectful keep calm and be courteous this is very important factor for personality development courtesy builds rapport enhances relations and yet in busy state of life people tend to forget to be courteous here some ways to be Polite. Give your full attention to the person whom you are interacting with in your day to day life. Not probe someone's personal life, not ask someone about their salary or personal or family issues. Say sorry when you are wrong. Give a smile when you meet someone or face someone. Treat others with humanity. Next point is work on your body language. Body language is very important powerful factor. We had body language before we had speech and apparently 70% of what you understand in a conversation is read through the body not our words it's what you don't say that counts learn to read and influence people through non-verbal communication here we have shown you an image in that five people are standing in different posture and attires you can see their body language if you see first girl she is standing with cross legs cross legs suggest she is not open to communicate and she has kept her hand nearby mouth it suggests she is lying in second image that person is standing his leg straight forward and wearing black goggles black goggles suggests he is hiding something we know we don't know what like that it's straight leg forward side it suggests menacing like he suggesting the presence of danger or he can threat someone. If you see third person, he is standing close legs and his both hands tightly closed. So it suggests his hostile attitude, insecure and aggression and close minded. Like that in fourth image, the girl is standing. She is smiling means she is interested but she kept her both hands nearby her vest. It suggests defense. Like that in last image, that person standing with tilt head and both hands he kept in his pockets. It suggests he thinks you are stupid and he is impatient to leave. It's a tendency to be quickly ir irritated or provoked. So dear friends, if you have not uh, subscribed this channel, please subscribe and like this video. So next point is check your attire. Attire is a most important factor. It's a single most powerful tool in making a good impression is dressed as neat and professional as possible. The clothes you wear reflect your personality, be it quirky, disciplined and sophisticated. Do you prefer bright colored clothes? Perhaps it's to do with your positive thoughts or if you have an eye for abstract prints, it is likely that you have a bold personality. What is relationship between clothes and personality? The clothes we wrap our bodies tell our own personal story. They portray to the world how we think and feel. They reflect our mood and our action. So clothes work when they are harmonious with the person. Next point is be professional at work. Here we have shown you some don'ts. Do not chew gum. Do not use mobile phone when you are talking to someone. Do not fold your arms because it's a negative sign or some aggression related thing. Do not lean, do not point at people and do not run like that. Some do's you can follow at your workplace and achieve success in your life like be friendly and polite. 
it will increase your communication be helpful give eye contact direct eye contact is show it shows your confidence and your positiveness listen other people stand straight and always smile smile will give a positive thing to other last point is be confident yourself being confident about who you are and what you are doing is the most important tip for personality development never doubt your capabilities read success stories or motivational videos or thoughts which helps you to attain a charming personality have faith in yourself self confidence is the inner faith which provides the greatest mental energy you can achieve or increase self confidence by little self analysis and effort how you can build your confidence here are some ways do internal analysis smiling generous and humble positive thinking by positive thinking you can increase your confidence accept responsibility do not run have courage and accept responsibility and try to do develop good habits prepare a bit before on things to be done so friends by these points you can increase your self confidence you can develop your personality thanks for watching this channel please subscribe our channel like and share this video